More gruesome details emerge as French terrorist suspect interrogated. France is still reeling from a lone wolf-style terrorist attack in which one man was beheaded. Roughly 10 a.m. June 26, 2015, Lyon resident Yassine Sali approaches the U.S.-owned air products factory in a van, a van that most likely also contains a severed head. Sali crashes through the factory fence and into a row of gas canisters, causing a small explosion which he survives. Sali then attempts to open a bottle of acetone in what authorities believe is a suicide attempt to destroy the factory. But the would-be bomber is overpowered by a firefighter working to extinguish the blaze. Sali is taken into custody. Only then do authorities find the severed head of Sali's boss tied to the factory fence, alongside banners featuring Islamic writing. On Saturday, it's discovered Sali sent a selfie of himself and the severed head via WhatsApp to a number in Canada. The picture soon pops up in Syria. Yahoo News reports French authorities say Sali has links to a radical sect of Islam, and investigators are now searching his home and combing through travel records. Salhi, a 35-year-old father of three, had worked as a driver for a transportation company since March, and the man he allegedly beheaded was the boss of that transportation company. Salhi's wife and sister spent two days in custody following the attack, but both have since been released. Leave an insightful comment on Tomonews.net, and you could win up to $500 every month.